to my channel. This is Katie with the Southern Ladies Ramblings and Katie Cannon Designs. I've been sharing my process over our, my finished pages over on Instagram with the 100 day project and I figured I would show you how I work a page like this. Um, I start out with a pencil sketch and I ink it and then paint it. So I figured today it would, might be nice to actually show you how I work through a page. Um, some of them are a little bit more detailed than others. Some of them are not as detailed. You know, some of them are pretty just not detailed at all. Um, but yeah, it's something that I've been working on. Um, this one, yesterday, it, this page really was a busy day. So I'm using um, Tombow Foodinesco brush markers. I have the one that actually works as a brush and the one that works as a fine pen. Um, I have some Uniball Vision pens, a fine pen. It's a waterproof, fade proof pen. Um, and then I have some Paper Studio fine line pens. Um, and they work really good. I have a water brush that's a Jane Davenport. It's the fine water brush. I normally sketch out my pages with pencil. And so yeah, let's get started. I'm probably gonna refine this a little bit before I actually finish it. Like these are basically just outline sketches. When I actually go to ink them is when they will be more detailed and things like that. Um, I start out with a 0 0.05 pen because I like to start out with something small. Then I can change it up if I want to. Um, I can thicken some lines and then and leave some thin. But basically all I do is I just go and my pencil lines are my reference. It's just like any other sketch. Doing um, can't talk and draw at the same time. Sorry about that. But just working. They give me an idea and then my pen, I use my pen to really refine and make the sketch cleaner. Sometimes it's very clean. Sometimes it's more rough. And then as you can tell here, I worked a lot on social media graphics yesterday, or yeah, this, I decided to, I drew it yesterday and would ink it this morning. But yeah, that's, so that, you know, so I, it, it does get a little messy looking when I um, get going and sometimes I will go ahead and erase it. And then sometimes I just leave it and do all the erasing at the end. But I'm going to speed this up now and I will come back right before I'm done. Okay, so I've got it inked, erased all the pencil line, and now I'm getting ready to start with watercolor. The watercolor set that I use is actually art philosophy. I just moved it into this Amy Tangerine art um, palette, but it's the um, watercolor confections. It is the classic set, and then I have some of the um, complexions set added in so whenever I'm drawing people. But this is the set I use. It, the reason I switched it, switched my paints into here is because of this. This little water bottle, I can fill up 
my water brushes wherever I'm at. As long as I keep this water bottle full, I've got water to fill up my brushes. There is a really, this is a really nice pen that comes with it. And I just didn't use it today. But this is the watercolor set that I'll be using. As I said, it's the um, Classics set by um, Art Philosophy Prima. Um, and then this is the Confections. So I'm gonna move it down here. And I'll see you on the other side. done with this page um, these are really you know they're just to illustrate my day to give me something to remember some pages I do way more detail some are not it just depends on what I did that day and this really was cleaning the house day and getting some a lot of work done um, but the fun of actually making the list and getting it, being able to check a bunch off and getting a lot of other stuff done. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe, and I